Yo, what's going on guys, Professor here, back again with another video. I'm currently 7,344 in the entire row with 2.6 hog, and I'll be showing you guys how I did it, and if you guys enjoyed the video, please make sure to like and sub, and I'll see you guys in the first game. On the first game here, I'm up against Frisky Dingo, so that's what he's playing. He's running Canyon here, it's gonna be kind of difficult matchup. Uh, Canyon is pretty good against the 2.6 hog, gotta be honest, because uh, it deals a lot of damage to the hog rider, and also same to the Ice Golem. And in here we should get one hog at least. Yeah, perfect. So, oh, whoa, whoa, where's my cannon? Okay, I'm back to cannon now. That is great. Let's go for my can over here. And I am having a little bit of Wi-Fi lag, to be honest. And I hate it when that happens when I'm uh, recording videos. Especially also when I am when I go live. So, yeah, I hope that it doesn't make a lot of difficulty for me. So in this video, we're going to be playing 2.6 hog and see how good it is and whether it's dead or not. Because... Uh, I've, 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 I get a lot of uh, comments about the 2.6 hog, whether it's uh, still alive or not. So in this video, we're going to be taking a look at it, whether it's good or not, or is it still alive or, or still alive or not. Because there's like a lot of uh, players on top ladder still playing it and getting pretty good finishes. Like, it's crazy for me that people still get like top 100 finish with 2.6 hog in this such a trash meta. Like... I would say every single meta, like every single EVO, after every single balance changes, the meta just keeps getting much worse and worse and worse for 2.6. Like EVO Drill, like EVO Pekka, EVO Mega Knight, everything just makes it like keep it keep it just keeps getting worse for the 2.6 hog. But somehow, some way, the deck is still alive. So I'm gonna just go for this and this. Oh, he got E Drag. Interesting. I was not expecting him to have E Drag. So, but we're gonna still get like two, three, two hog shots, two hog shots, which is pretty nice. So, let's go for my ice golem over here, and I'm gonna try to activate my king tower in my uh, musketeer against this e drag. So, I'm gonna go musketeer now, and then that should I no, I should have placed it like I should have placed it like one millisecond later, bro. Okay, that sucks, but it's fine. It doesn't really matter, I guess. Yeah, because I'm facing RG, so king tower is not gonna help me out a lot. So, uh, as I go for my hog over here, he messed up the tombstone hog, he's gonna go to the tower. And then if he plays fisherman, I'm gonna fireball it, never mind, he didn't. And we got no damage, you guys can see how broken, um, cannoneer is and how, how good it is against the, uh, the hog rider. So, I just go for my log over here and that should be clean defense, wow, evil ice bear just clutched up over there, gotta be honest. Let's go for my ice golem over here and then I'm gonna skellies and then hog. Skellies just in case if he goes for the fisherman. So yeah, then fisherman is gonna lock onto the skeletons and it's gonna it's not gonna lock onto the hog or ice golem and we're gonna get a lot more value. So let's go for my um musketeer at the back, same lane of the fisherman. And then I guess I'll just cycle my cannon, to be honest. Yeah, I'm gonna go ice golem over here to protect my musketeer and then I'll go for my log. Okay. So, um, I can't go for my evil skills on top of the RG, but I have to be careful because he got Mother Witch and he might go ahead and predict it. I'll go Fireball. Yep, there is the Mother Witch. Uh, I'll just go for the Musketeer, Ice Golem, so it tanks, and then I'll go for my evil skeletons. I'm gonna lock these skeletons at right hand lane away, and then i just go for the Ice Spirit and then Hog Rider to tank for the, you know, that's E-Drag. He's gonna, whoa, 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 chill, 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 skellies. Uh, am I dead? I guess I am. Uh, good I'm back to Evil Ice Spirit though. Evil Ice Spirit is gonna clutch up over here once again. Okay, perfect. Gonna go Ice Golem low for the Mother Witch and we should be fine. The Fisherman is gonna get one stab on my tower. But yeah, I can't do much about that one. So I'm gonna go for my Hog over here and then I'm gonna... Okay, Musketeer. I'll go for the Log and then I'm gonna go Skeletons for the Fisherman. Because I'm pretty sure he's gonna play it. So, Fisherman. Yep, there it is. I'm gonna go for the Ice Bird now, and then I'm gonna go for this Ice Golem. Wait, I'm gonna Fireball that to protect my Musketeer. That's gonna be an insane Fireball. I'll go ahead and bang, Fireball that, and then I'm gonna go for my Hog Rider. I should get some nice value over here. <sighs> no, that Tombstone, I wasn't expecting to play like that. Okay, but to be honest, really, really good Tombstone. I just then gotta give him the credit. Kinda late Ice Golem, but doesn't matter. I'm gonna just go Hog into that Ice Golem, doesn't really matter. Gonna go for my log over here, predict the tombstone. Okay, nice. Wait, one more hog hit? No, that sucks. Wait, wait, I, I might have lost the game, bro. I might have, I, I have to cycle back to the, I have to cycle back to the uh, fireball as soon as possible. Okay, we're back and that's gonna be game over. Yep, really nice one over there against RG and I'll see you guys in the next game. The next game here, I'm up against Abib. So let's see what he playing. 
gonna start with my playing my just go gonna go hog the bridge just see what does he have and then i'm gonna be ready with my log just in case if he goes like i don't know bait card or something so he's gonna go pekka we got one shot okay that was not evo pekka's yeah I'm pretty sure that was not evo so it's gonna be interesting to see what does he have for the evos he got the wizard i guess i'm gonna fireball over here it's like i would say it might look like a bad fireball but trust me i guess it's a good fireball because it's gonna the musketeer is gonna stay alive like pretty much healthy and he has to just play something if i didn't play that fireball the wizard would have you know damaged down the musketeer and yeah the packer would have uh, also stayed alive and like pretty much with, with some hp left so kind of bad log timing on my end but it doesn't really matter he got, got recruits what i go hog into those recruits to be honest because it's not like super bad play we're gonna get like two hog shots that's what matters and then i'm gonna go for my also honestly i'm gonna just go musketeer and then i'll just go for my skellies to kite those <sighs> he got the whoa, whoa, whoa he got the void okay i gotta be careful now this matchup is gonna be really really bad bro with that he got evil recruits he got evil wizard and he got the void it's gonna make this like 100 times worse i'm gonna just go for the hogger over here because the musketeer is alive on one hp and he has to play something for that Otherwise, we're going to get, like, some nice damage. One hog hit, bro. Seriously, I'm getting scammed at the left-hand lane. Okay, let's go for this over here. Skeletons up high. Uh, Ice Golem to kite. And then lock. No, the Ice Golem is not going to kite, bro. No way, man. I have to waste the... I have to waste the Ice Bird. Okay, it's, it 6. Now I'm down Elixir, I guess. Like, 2 to 3 Elixir I'm down. And that's really, really bad, gotta be honest. Because on this next push, I'm going to be low-key dead. So he's gonna go for the recruits. Let's go for my musketeer. And then I'm gonna just cycle my cannon. See what he is going to do. He might go for the void. I just try to predict it. That was oh no. Oh my god, I'm so cooked now. I don't have my cannon. I don't have my musketeer in the field. And he's gonna zap that, bro. How many spell are this guy's running? I thought he only has void and zap, bro. Okay, that's gonna be a lot of damage for him. I was I did not know that he has arrows. That arrow's void value was insane on top of the ice golem, cannon, and the musketeer. Okay, now we're losing. Gotta we gotta focus now. We gotta lock in. Let's go for the hog over here. I'm gonna just go for the lock. Just do you know push back those troops away. And the hogger should get like two shots. One shot, that's also fine. Gonna go for the musketeer, scale to predict the void. There it is. And then we're gonna go ice golem. It doesn't really matter if he arrows this. If he does, I'm gonna just go for the cannon. And then he can kill the cannon. So that's gonna be a good uh yeah that's gonna be a good thing for me uh let's go for another musketeer and then log on top of these skellies and i guess i don't i'm gonna go ice comb just to be safe and then wait i'm gonna go hog i'm gonna go ice spirit as well what is he gonna do about this like that's gonna be a lot of damage if the ice spirit jumps on top of those recruits okay one more hit one more hit perfect 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 that's nice i'm gonna go for the musketeer over here and then evo skelly he's gonna avoid this the evo skelly's all gonna die that sucks that actually sucks okay uh, i'm gonna go for the log fireball that's gonna be insane bang killed everything great mm, i'm gonna go hog over here and then i'm gonna go ice spirit or never mind uh wait what is he doing that's gonna get like one hit that's gonna be fireball yeah that was like super super late course of this in i'll just cycle back to fireball and that's gonna be gg so really nice and over there against recruits pekka and I'll see you guys in the next game on the last game here i'm up against goes in so let's see what he playing i'm gonna start about playing my skeletons to get back to their evil form and see what does he have he also has evil skeletons let's go for my ice spirit i guess that's not gonna splash i played like one second later okay i should have played one second sooner that that way it would have killed the skellies and also um you know splash on the tower I'm gonna go for my log on top of this and we should get one hog hit Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. That was like Ian77 hog over there. Okay, let's go for the cannon. Musketeer as well because I'm pretty sure this guy's running. Earthquake, gonna go for this, this. And perfect. No damage for him from that hog rider. That's great. Okay, hog EQ. Interesting. I'm gonna go hog over here because he does not have a... What is it called? A bomb tower in hand, but... He can't... What? I was not expecting to have goblins. He had goblins and skeletons. Interesting okay uh all right that's gonna be kind of bad i guess because if i try to log like the skelly is gonna get back to a goblin so that kind of sucks i don't know how this matchup is gonna go but we'll see 
Uh, okay, I'm gonna just go from musk <sighs> cannon musketeer, and we should be fine. I don't need the voice, but I'm pretty sure that's gonna counter that because of the king's activation as well. Okay, perfect. Gonna go for my ice golem over here, and then he is back to the bomb tower. He might go for it. I'm gonna fireball that. Yeah, I'm gonna fireball that to be honest. And then I'm gonna just play my Evo Skellies on top of this to take it down. He might pop the BWD. Okay, he did pop the BWD and also went for the uh, log prediction. I'm gonna just go for this and then Evo Ice Spirit for the goblins or something. Okay, perfect. That's gonna kill the goblins. And bruh, he's back. <laughs> he's playing Evo Skellies now. Yeah, you guys can see how much, uh, how much Evo Skeleton, how much Skeleton and goblins are helping him out. If that was like an Ice Spirit or something, we would have got like two, three Hog Rider shots, but. Yeah, it is what it is. Gonna be ready with my cannon if he goes hog. If there it is, I'm gonna just push it off to the earthquake range. That is pretty much nice. And then I'll go for my hog. It's gonna go for the bomb tower. It's completely okay with me. I'll just, um, not gonna fireball that, I guess. I'll just let that one go. I'm gonna, nah, okay. I wanted to play like log prediction or something, but it doesn't matter. I'm gonna just go for my skeletons up high. Musketeer. He is back to hog rider, right? Yep, he is. Uh, no, I want to play cannon. I accidentally played the ice golem. No. Okay, that sucks. That actually sucks. That's gonna be a lot of damage for him. Okay, nice. The whole guy didn't get the second shot. That's nice. Wait, I'm gonna fire prediction goblins. Bro, what was I thinking about? What was I thinking about? Okay, at least I got one musketeer shot. That's what matters. Okay, I'm gonna go for the uh, log as well just to be safe. And like, okay, perfect. And now I am gonna just go for my ice golem at the bridge. Don't wanna wanna go hog, but he's gonna go bomb tower. I just fireball that, I guess. And then I am gonna go for my. Okay, he's gonna go hog. Pretty sure yeah, there it is. Cannon up high. Evo ice spirit. And then wow, man, you gotta chill back. I'm gonna just log in. That should be enough. Okay, perfect. Gonna go for my ice golem plus hog right at the bridge. See what he's going to do. He's gonna go. Uh, okay, for a second I thought he messed up the placement, but he didn't because I placed my hog rider at the middle. So I'm gonna be rid of my cannon if he goes hog rider. Okay, hog, perfect. Now that's gonna go to the no. He earthquake on top of that. That was like such a gonna such a good earthquake at his end. Uh, log. Okay, bruh, that's still a lot of damage, man. This matchup sucks. Hog EQ is really good against 2.6, especially the fact that this guy is running. But the fact that this guy's running bomb tower is gonna it's helping him out a lot. And we should get one hog hit. No, he locked. Okay, it's fine. Uh skellies. Ice spirit. Uh ice golem plus hog at the bridge because he's not back to his bomb tower. I'm gonna fireball over here. I thought I'm gonna I thought he's gonna play goblins, but he didn't. Okay. Skellies up high. Cannon. Evil Ice Spirit. Musketeer. Uh, I'm somehow, some way, I'm winning. That's kind of nice. It's gonna go log. No, the musket is gonna hit. The fire is gonna get a hit. Okay, that sucks. Let's go for the cannon up high. And then, uh, skellies. No, I'm not gonna play skellies. I just log that. Okay, wait. Hold up. Fireball? That's that's a really bad bomb tower. The hog rider should get a hit for us. Yo! One hit! Come on! No, that's... Bro. Okay, it is what it is. Uh, gonna predict the hog. No, we didn't. Okay, I tried to go for, like, hog prediction. But he didn't play it. It doesn't matter though. I'm already back to another set of cannon. So that one matters. Okay, I need a I need one log and fireball. Fireball is not gonna be enough, I'm pretty sure. <sighs> cycle, 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 cycle. Okay, we're back to cannon. I mean log, and that should be GG. So really nice innovative day against Hoggy Q. And if you guys enjoyed the video, please make sure to like and sub and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.